tell when your baby is coming. Well, That's a week from today, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah One week. We went to the birthing class, and the woman got, like, a replica of a nine-pound baby and got, like, a hip bone. It was like, it doesn't fit. And, like, <laughs> and Chris was like, <laughs> ever since Chris found out she was pregnant, she's been loving those pregnancy shows. And she's like, I, every time I'll, I'll have some food, and she'll be like, let's watch this. And you flip the channel, and it's just the baby coming out like, Wah! and I'm like, that's it. I'm like, okay. <laughs> I actually got three leathers in the mail today. So as opposed to the other day, which was double leather madness, this is triple leather madness. I'm so excited. What's it say, Steven? All right, this, this. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like my dad filming Christmas 1991. This first leather is from Jamestown, North Dakota. Awesome. Okay. All right. And on the back it says, bending this kills a baby kitten. Bend it. All right. <laughs> This is a, uh, this is a Steven Island, apparently. Do I really look like that? Yeah. yeah, yeah you got that look sure. on your face most you of the know, time. That, that <laughs> okay, well You that's... do wear a red t-shirt a lot, or is that a Snuggie? You're wearing a, a Snuggie. Snuggie. <laughs> I don't wear a Snuggie. Sleeping in the aviary. Do you guys know what that means? Is that a band? Is that a song? I don't know. Steven, been enjoying the vlog. Included is my signed land, which is also my first custom painted magic card. Cool. I threw in some of my art flyers for the hell of it. I did a vlog, one a week, during an art tour, summer 2008, and I'm impressed by your output. It's tough work. Sending support from the Midwest, Billy J. Billy Joel? <laughs> no. I wonder. Bill, Billy J. Billy J. Does the J stand for Joel? No, it J-A-Y. Oh. Billy J. Oh, I know you're just... <laughs> oh, Billy really Joel... Bad. Painted a magic card. Yeah, I don't think so. Billy J is a username. His, his name is uh, William Hessian. So I will link over to his website on the under bar because he did include that in here. And he also included this little sketches and stuff like we have like the dinosaur versus the caveman. We all know on that one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Thank you again, Will slash Billy J. All right, next we have Jeremy in Baltimore, Maryland. I actually talked to Jeremy prior, and I will uh, link to his profile right here, because Jeremy deals with guitar pedals. He does some really cool, interesting things. Check out that. He told me prior he was going to mail me these unglued booster packs, which is basically like the joke magic cards. So, thank you for that. Oye, Esteban, have a ghost with those cards or something. Also, T, not writing with caps today. Yes. From Jeremy. P.S. If you mention the YouTube channel, warn about crap songs and noisy demos. There's crap songs and noisy demos. He sent this to me the other day, and I had not seen it until just now, but he sent me a file and was like, I have a high quality version of this, so. Possessed Magic Tones. Boing. Is that fancy juice? <laughs> After you be deriding my fancy juice? <laughs> Mango green tea and ginger peach green tea. Thank you very much, Jeremy, and uh, everybody should check out Jeremy's channel. And this last letter is uh, from Mechanicsville, Maryland. This is from Chelsea. I already know that this is Tiramisuki. You're really bad at being a camera. What? No, I'm doing the no, clover field. Don't do the clover field. Don't be retarded. I wish Dan was here, but he's not. Oh, we got some origami stuff. I don't know what this is, but I think it's an R wing. I think that's a swan. <laughs> <laughs> Is it just... It's a swan. Oh, it is a swan. Wow. Oh. But dude, doesn't it look like an R-wing like this? Nah. It looks like, like if this was straight, it's an R-wing. Yeah. But yeah, it's, okay, it's a swan. Yeah. Alright, and then also... Oh, it's one of those things. Okay, you play. Pick one. What? Pick one! They're blank! Oh. How do I pick one? I don't know. Okay. What number? Get one. Me. So we look at this one. Oh wait, there's nothing on this. I think maybe that was a creative way of folding up a note. I had some leftover scrap paper after making the pocket, so yeah. Oh, we just played a game that didn't exist. <laughs> Dear Steven, keep being awesome. Sincerely, Chelsea. Also a belated happy birthday and happy Easter. And the following is also to Dan and Alex. And then there's some drawings of like a snail. And some stuff from Earthbound, and that's a cat. A fancy crab with a monocle. 
She did this very fancy pocket thing. Chelsea Land. This is all very nicely packaged. Thank you very much, Drew Masuki, for all of your uh, drawings and this thing that I thought was a game that is not a game. And your Arwing Swan. One! <laughs> so one more time. Thanks again, Billy J, who is Will Hessian. Jeremy. And thanks again to Chelsea Tiramisuki. Jeremy has a username, but I can never pronounce it because it's really long. So thank all three of you. This is awesome. And you guys rock. Thanks. I got the lands in here, the Stephen Island, but it's Will Island, really. And then down here is the Chelsea Island, and then the Mallory Island. So now we only have one island free. So the ones that are available as of today are... Don't freak out if, like, you've already mailed one that's been taken or something like that. Just, like, don't worry about it. Even if it's already taken up or I get duplicates or I run out of space, they're still going up. I'm going back through everything that I got. Uh, there was a lot of stuff that arrived in the mail today. For the record, I, I've been checking the mail every day. It's not like I just waited a while because I wanted there to be three letters. Like, I've been checking every day and all this stuff happened to come at today. But I checked out William Hessian's site, williamhessian.com. It's actually really, really good. There's a lot of good artwork on here, but I, I gotta say that my favorite thing I've found so far is the bearded bunnies. Maybe it's just because it's uh, cool and unusual, and I like things that are different. Check out williamhessian.com, and, and <laughs> if you don't do anything else, look at the bearded bunnies, because it's, it's really funny. Very honored to have his first custom-painted magic card. It was definitely a surprise seeing my face on one, and uh, I really do appreciate it a lot, so thanks again, man. And as I said, I'm still going through everything, and I have two packs of old, old magic cards. Let's open them and see what's inside. For those who are not aware, um, I'm sure there's plenty of people watching who aren't magic players. There were two sets released called Unglued and Unhinged, where they basically made fun of their own card game. So we have cards like... Knight of the Hokey Pokey, where you can tap mana and do the Hokey Pokey, where you must stand up, wiggle your butt, raise your hands above your head, shake them wildly as you rotate 360 degrees. And the flavor text at the bottom says that's what it's all about. The image there kind of reminds me of the Ultimate Chimera. Somewhat. But once again, thanks Jeremy for uh, sending them. The card pack is old, so I, I probably never would have had a chance to have opened one like this. And they're all really funny, so thanks for sending it. And definitely everyone not only checking out William Hessian's site, but also Jeremy's YouTube account. Checking out some of the demo stuff he's done. And, and I'm supposed to warn about crappy stuff, but it's it's really not bad at all. Tiramisuke, your swan is going to reside up here. As soon as Dan gets back from that party, I will show him your drawings. I sincerely enjoyed it. So I also want to give a big thanks to you. Getting three letters is a big deal, so thanks a lot, guys. I appreciate it. And if you're watching and you're saying, wow, I want to send random stuff to you, well, you can. Just click on my, my channel name, the Steven Vlog thing, and then once you get on that page, the address is down there, and you can send stuff, and I'll get it. How was your deal? It was fun. Uh, Dan made me a cake, which was nice. Holy crap! They made you, you a cake, you a cake on your the, second visit to the, the party Jesus land. Jesus Halo. Yeah. Yeah. At Jesus Halo. <laughs> 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 I wish all churches were named Jesus Halo. This is from Tiramisuki. She drew a taco. <laughs> That's funny. And there's some other drawings. The taco is the one I feel is related to you. Don't startle the witch. That's funny. Like or, draw or next Hey, that's for you. Yeah, I was an exit mouse once. So she sent this one? Uh huh. And then another guy sent this one. <laughs> <laughs> is that awesome? That is incredible. How did they do I looked that? up I looked up his website, he's like a really good artist and he painted it. Can he do all of us? <laughs> That'd be so great. Please. I, I mean I mean I know it takes time and effort and lots of talent, but Dan wants to be if, drawn so please, badly on a magic card. If you could draw all four of us <laughs> That would be oh. awesome, and then we'd be, it would be like Hollywood Squares. Not really, but it would be, oh, it's so great. That, like, looks like you, man. Like, if somebody were to draw all that is really magic good. cards, we would need, like, a Whoopi Goldberg or, like, an <laughs> Alice the Maid in the center. The other ones would have to be filled with Brady children. The Brady children. 
another thing worth mentioning is that uh, today we were allowed to sign up for the exact same room, so the exact same place we're in now, next year if we wanted to stay in the same place. And we said, okay, sure. Everything that you see now will be very familiar for a, another entire year. Up into vlog day, like, 500, you're going to be seeing a lot of the same rooms. In just a few more weeks, I'll be going home, so you will no longer be able to send mail here because I won't get it. I am going to get an address for you guys and put it up there whenever I get a chance, but there will probably be a period of one or two weeks um, near the end where you won't be able to send mail. So I'll let you guys know. For right now, if you have mail to send, send away, but uh, I'll keep you guys informed of that.